In this video, I'm going to be doing two nail art designs. The first one is inspired by the movie Beetlejuice, and the second one is inspired by the movie Goonies. Now, I'm just going to say this up front. I am not a huge fan of both of these movies, but I know that it's like a classic Halloween movie. I've only ever seen Beetlejuice once in my life, and I've never actually watched the full movie of The Goonies, but my dad loves The Goonies. So I'm going to be doing an alert design inspired by both of these movies. And this is the colors that I have on for the Beetlejuice one. The white polish is Zoya's Snow White. The black polish is Zoya's Willa. And this lime green is Zoya's Link. Okay, for my pinky finger, on um, for my pinky finger, I'm going to be doing this checkered design. For my ring finger, I'm going to be doing what appears to be a black stripe on top of white with some lime green slime coming down on it. Okay. I'm just making three guide dots basically to help me with making sure that these turn out as straight and as even as possible. I'm going to take the same green nail polish that I had on and drips with it. Okay. And I'm just going to redefine the drippy drips finger or the black fingernail. I am going to. I'm going to freehand a spider web with white acrylic paint. I'm only going to do the spider web like halfway down to the tip of my nail. I'm not going to do the full nail as a spider web. Okay, whoops, there we go. I just got done freehanding a spider web on this nail. I'm going to put some little nail art study things on them. And I'm just gonna actually do this my own way. I think I'm gonna do lime green and then dark green and then some silver ones. Maybe I should start with the lime green, the dark green. And I'm going to attach these with just some clear top coat. Okay, that is the emerald green ones. And now for the lime green ones which look very silver. One thing I have learned when it comes to working with nail art studs or nail art decals on your nails is they actually stick better when your top coat isn't like dripping wet. It's better to do it better to put the nail art studs on when the top coat is um 
almost dry because then I feel like the taco gives a better grip to the enamel studs. And then the blue, I'm gonna little line right there. But that's just what's worked for me when it comes to doing nail art studs is I just put the top coat on and I'll let it dry for a few seconds and then I will start putting them on. That way I feel like, like I said, I feel like it gives it a bit better grip. All right, so this is the Beetlejuice nail. We got checkerboard floor, if whatever that's called. Uh, this looks kind of like Buzz Lightyear, but it got his suit with some slime on it. Uh, classic spiderweb nail, which I apparently smudged. Whoops. Um, I have no idea what this is called. And then this. And now for the Goonies design. I actually looked up some of the iconic stuff from Goonies and most of it's like pirate stuff. So I have some stamping plates that I'm gonna be using. And these are the polishes that I'm wearing. This is on my pinky. It's called, normally I try to pronounce it but I'm not gonna try to pronounce that. The gold polish I'm wearing is this one which looks ironically like crushed up gold. So I thought this was perfect. Old nails, I'm just going to do the simple treasure look that I see. And I do have a, a little nail stud picker upper thingy but I'm just using a very fine dotting tool to do this. You could also use a toothpick too. All go, and then one more. Oops. Okay, one now. On my index finger, I'm just going to do a skull On my middle finger, I'm going to be doing this pirate image. Apparently Goonies is all about piratey type stuff. And that's... On my pinky finger, I'm going to be doing well, it looks like a treasure map type. I don't know why, but these type of skull thingies remind me of Pirates of the Caribbean. And this is going to go right on. Add a quick dry top coat. I don't know why, but I feel like when you add top coat to something, especially a stamp design, I feel like it makes it more like prominent. Or I could just be imagining that. Okay. So these are the Goonie nails. Like I said, because I don't know the movie Goonies that well, I don't really know what's like the iconic stuff of it, but I know that it's about pirates and trying to find stuff. So this is what I came up with. 